I've wanted to do this for a while, and it's time for you to get involved. Part number one, part number two, part number three, part number four, and all I have left to do is build the fifth part, but it's taking an excessive amount of time to get this thing made. But that's okay because it gives me the perfect opportunity to do a contest for a giveaway that I've had in mind for a really long time. Before I forget, Alex Taylor won the Patreon giveaway for the small Warhorn from the last video. And because that video had such an insane response for just being a test build video, I decided to call out all builders and makers to take part in this contest. Hashtag human powered PVC Warhorn challenge. I like long hashtags, I think they're funny. Don't be afraid to pester your favorite YouTubers to try to get them involved in this challenge. Here's a couple of my favorite YouTubers that I hope get involved. Colin Furs, The Hacksmith, Sufficiently Advanced, Grant Thompson, The King of Random, Adam, Mother Savage, His channel is tested. I like to make stuff. York Sprob, Slingshot Channel, Brain Foo TV, Friggin' Boom Toys, Boom! Gear, Greek Gadget Guru, Cody's Lab, because who doesn't want to see a warhorn go off inside of a mine? The Backyard Scientist, because <sighs> neighbors, William Osmond, AVE, Peter Brown, Nighthawk in light, Maker in training, ZNA Productions, but only if he makes it out of diamond plate, Full Metal Engineering, Fortis, Fort, Fortis, Fortass, Peter Sripple, Dustin Penner, Mark Roper, and last but not least, Michael Cthulhu. Feel free to bug those people so that they get the message, but mostly, I want you to do it. What's the incentive for you to do it? I'm glad you asked. There's prizes, but mostly you should do it because it's something that you made, and it's one of a kind, and you'll get a ton of satisfaction out of making something, and it's fun. And here's the rules for the contest. You have to subscribe and comment on this video and like this video and follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I'm kidding. You don't have to do any of that stuff but it would help if you did. All you have to do is in the title of the video, put hashtag human powered PVC Warhorn challenge. Make sure the video is posted on YouTube by midnight, August 23rd, Eastern US time. The video can be a build video or you can just use your horn. Your horn has to have at least one piece of PVC, whether it's a coupler or pipe in it somewhere. It has to be human powered, so the power has to originate from you. You can use your breath, your hands, mechanical stuff, and turning cranks and gears and chains, but no chemical energy like fuel powered engines or batteries. Except if you power a generator that stores energy and batteries and the batteries power the thing that runs it because the power is still originated from you. Also use any fasteners you want, glue, rivets, screws, whatever. Last rule, be safe. If you do something dangerous that poses a threat to other people or yourself, then I'm probably not going to use the video. If you're worried about how you could possibly compete if a bunch of big YouTubers get involved, don't worry, I'm about to explain the judging criteria. I want you to have fun building and try new things, so your horn doesn't have to be epically huge like mine as long as I see ingenuity in how you made it, or how you used it, or how good the video is presented. That matters more than just spending a bunch of money on something, kind of like, like I did, to make a really huge horn. The point is, everybody's got a chance. You don't have to make the loudest or the longest or the fattest one to win. And don't forget to do multiple takes to try to make your video interesting and watchable because I'll probably end up watching a whole lot of these. I might end up watching a whole lot of these things. It depends if you guys actually do this. But what do you get for winning the contest? I thought long and hard about this one. Every single person that does the challenge will get their video added to a playlist on my channel of everybody that did the human powered PVC Warhorn challenge. Hashtag. First, second, and third place will all get custom made ribbons for being in the contest and winning first, second, and third place that I'll send out to you. And then the grand prize gets my hand. No, seriously, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you my right hand. Remember when I made a mold and cast of my arm for the Iron Man rocket launcher build? I still have the hand, the arm broke off. Grand prize gets this. I'm gonna make a trophy out of it but sand my fingerprints off so that you don't commit crimes with my fingers. I'll also announce that you're the grand prize winner, put a link to your video in the description, and you'll get to help me plan my next project. You probably noticed that finger broke off, but I'll fix that before I send it. Also, if you wanna check out the channels that I talked about, I'll put links down in the description to every channel that I mentioned, and I'll also put a link to the website that I found that has a comprehensive guide on how horns are made, and it has a couple of simple equations that you can use to calculate the shape of your horn. The only question that I think you could still have is when am I going to test my horn and announce the winners and all that stuff. Midnight of the 23rd is the deadline, so August 24th is when that video is coming out. But don't worry, I've got some really awesome projects between now and then. That's it. Hashtag Human Powered PVC Warhorn Challenge. If you want to win a piece of my body, go build a horn. Make a video.
Good thing PVC is resilient to all of the channels that I mentioned down in the in the.